You are the best thing that has ever happened to me. There are countless reasons as to why I want to spend the rest of my life with you. The biggest reason is because you never fail to pour your heart and soul into our relationship. Catherine Rose Balagard, I love you. You have brought such joy to my life. Thank you for loving and believing me as I am and taking me into your heart. You are the biggest blessing in my life. I fell in love with your kindness, ambition, thoughtfulness, and of course, your sense of humor. I promise to walk by your side forever, to love, to help, and to encourage you in all that you do. I will take the time to talk to you, to listen to you, to take care of you through all the changes in our lives. I will be there for you always, as strength in need, comfort in sorrow, counselor in difficulty, and a companion in joy. You know how much my family means to me, and I adore the fact that they love you so much. Honey, I'm so proud of the man you've become. You've really put in time and effort into building our future together, and I can't ask for a better partner to spend the rest of my life with. I can't wait to see the look on your face when I walk down the aisle. We'll see who will cry first. I promise to work on our love and always will have you in my priority in my life. Everything I am, everything I have is yours, now and forever. This is my promise to you. I give you this ring, wear it with love and joy, as this ring has no end. Need a shot, my love for you. I choose you to be my wife this day and forevermore. I will love you today, tomorrow, and for the rest of our lives. Jason and Catherine, if there is one good reason that we are all gathered here today, it's because we are here to celebrate the love of Jason and Catherine and to make it holy to the covenant of marriage. They met when they were in college. They were in the club at the time with a college roommate. Jason became so persistent that on the second time around in a different club again, when they met each other, this time he was good enough to ask the phone number and they had their first date and they went out for a dinner in a diner. And actually, they keep talking and texting for all three months until one day at Roosevelt Island, way back 2008, Jason finally said, Would you be my girlfriend? And they built up that relationship for 10 years prior for them being here. Supported by friends, family, 10 years of a good relationship, coming to know each other. And after 10 years and 2018 in the same place at Roosevelt Island, Jason made the proposal. And today they're here 
to seal that love and the presence of all of you and to make it the real reality that they are very, very serious enough to make this a sacrament of marriage. funny person. He's probably one of the funniest people I've ever met. He makes Catherine laugh so much. Not only does he make Catherine laugh, he also makes both my parents laugh too. <laughs> he has, you know, a lot of jokes, a lot of sayings, a lot of these like things that, you know, my sister starts picking up, my parents start saying, I even start saying it too. He's very funny. <laughs> and, you know, Jason, we're very glad to have you in our family. I've never seen this man fall head over heels that fast for any girl until he met you, Kat. You were everything he was missing and needed in his life. Jason told me if it weren't for you, he probably wouldn't be where he is at now. You've motivated him to do better in life. You've made him to a better him. And his success in life is thanks to you. I'm thankful for that and glad to have you be a part of the family. Congratulations. Jason, honestly, at the cat, you grew to be confident about yourself and shine, just how Jason is very confident about himself, too. I see how happy that you make my sister, and I, you know, I wish the best for both of you. 